on today's episode of Fix It Your Motherfucker Self, we got a 1991 Nissan Hardbody. Yeah, baby. I remember I wanted one of these motherfuckers back in the day. But yeah, we got a whole gang of things we're going to put in here. Let me show y'all the goodies we got inside that the custom box that we're going to put in here. So, if y'all not familiar with this, it comes with two speakers in each door. One over there, one over there. We got this we're going to put in, the two door speakers. Then we got old Kenwood radio we're going to put in. And we got a Rockfield, Rockfield sub amp. She already has another amp in the back, but we're going to use that for the door speakers and then use this one for the sub. So, this is a sub slash um, amp all rolled up in one. So, we're going to get started. We're going to holler at y'all a little bit. All right, first what we're going to do is we're going to take out these his, this old seat here because we want to get all the room we can to wire everything up. So. I think it's four, one on this side, one on the other side, one on the back, one on that side on the back. Now, I believe these are either a 13 or 12 millimeter. When I get the socket out, I'll let y'all know. And we'll be back in a minute. We're gonna open up the hood latch there. And we're gonna disconnect the battery. I mean, I can do this with one hand, y'all, but we're gonna show try. Yeah, this old school hood. We're gonna have to put the phone down and use both hands. So we'll be back in a minute, y'all. Now we're gonna disconnect the battery. So we get that done, we'll move on to the next step, y'all. As y'all can see, it's 12 millimeters. Get the other one up. two in the back out we're gonna have a child in a minute well we got the old seat out as y'all can see over there and we got the old rigid vacuum shout out to jason for the vacuum you know what i'm saying and we're gonna get this old girl cleaned on up and then you see the old amp right there that's just gonna be the door speaker amp and we're gonna put the other one right there so we're gonna have a child in a minute now we got it mostly everything out we're gonna get the old, the old radio up out of here so we're gonna get the head out. Let me see what you got. You kill first, you gotta pretty much take the ashtray out. And I may have to have both my hands for that. Yeah, well, maybe not. Take that out. And then this trim should just pop right off. So it looks like we got two Phillips head screws right there. And then after that, these will come out. So we're gonna have to try in a minute, get that off here. Then after you get out the trim piece, you gotta get these two screws right, these two Phillips heads right there. And the radio should come right on out. So no walker putting it to work. comes right on now. So after we get everything disconnected, we'll haul it out in a minute. It's just simple right there. Disconnect all that shit and be ready to go. Haul it out in a minute. Yes, everybody, look who came to help me out. My pretty little girl, Miss Davion. You say hi to everybody? <laughs> She's geared to go to her school orientation because today was the first day of school. So. They're gonna do that, and I'm gonna be working on this. So, here's a wiring harness. In case anybody need the part number for this old 1991 hard body. And we're gonna get this old radio wired up. We're gonna have a in a minute. All right, ladies and gentlemen. We added a relay because we got two amps gonna be in here. So, most times the radio wiring is not gonna be enough power two different amps so we got a relay in so now we're about to hook this up to the radio 
hook the battery back up real quick and just test out, make sure everything works with the, um, the radio. After that, we're gonna get to uh, put the door speakers in and the amp and all that good stuff and be back in a little while. Well, as y'all can hear, we got the battery hooked back up. We're gonna turn the switch and see what it do. Y'all can see, the motherfucker is plugged up, goddamn. So, we're gonna house out a minute and get everything else prepared. We'll see y'all later. As y'all can see, we got the dash kit on and got the radio put back together. Now we're gonna clean up our mess on the inside, put the seat back in. Then we're gonna tack these old door speakers and this one will be done, got that. See, we got the amp slash sub hooked up right there. We're gonna clean all that up and be done with this motherfucker. As y'all can see, everything's back together. Can't even tell nothing been done in this motherfucker. No wires, no nothing. You know what I'm talking about? So now we're gonna get on here to the door speakers and switch them out. So we're gonna hot y'all in a minute. Alright, first off, when you're taking off a window crank, there's a clip that sits right behind the window crank. You get you old pick and find here. Get you a pick, pull that clip right up out of the Get this little pick in there, reach in there, pull it out. And then it just comes right off. So, we're gonna hold y'all in a minute. And I'll try to pull this a little bit. The door trim, but actually, once you get the rest of it off, you don't pull it all the way off because you'll break this. So you let the, when you pull the door, let it pull it off. Well, there you have it. Back. Door panel is off. You got two screws. They go right there on the door handle and you don't have to worry about pulling them out because they don't come out and then the lock you just unscrew that and that's it man see the door panel right there so we're gonna get to change out this bullshit well let me make this real quick because i don't want to get monetized by youtube so matter of fact how about i just pause it but y'all can hear that it's playing so See y'all what we done did. Got the door speakers there. You know what I'm saying? Got the new radio right there. You know what I'm saying? Got the sub back there. You don't even know it's back there. You know what I'm talking about? So this is a wrap, goddammit. It's been, you know, been a motherfucking job right here. We done got this thing in there. So we're gonna have to tell them. Hey right, ladies and gentlemen, this has been another episode of Fixing Your Motherfucking Self on this old 1991 hard body. You know, a little Nissan thing. We're gonna have a job the next time, right?